Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel Mihix. So today I am doing a little different kind of a video. Uh, 25 random and not so random facts about me. So I realized that not many of y'all uh, know me really well. And I thought of doing this video so that we can get to know me really well. I can't get to know you all without watching your video, right? I mean, it's just a one way thing. Anyway. <laughs> So, um, I'll just tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Mihika. I am 21 years old. Uh, I've done my graduation in Bachelors of Mass Media and now I'm doing YouTube because I love doing it and I plan on doing it for a long time now. And for more random and not so random facts about me, stay tuned. Fact number one, I love makeup. I mean, I'm obsessed with makeup. I was never this makeup obsessed person all my life. Uh, I never even used makeup or even a lipstick, I think, before I was 19. Like, as I turned 19, I don't know what got into me and I suddenly had this awakening that I need makeup in my life and there's no going back since that point. And I love makeup. And I mean, I watch YouTube makeup tutorials all day. I try and play with makeup, transform new looks, I mean I try to do so and I am very passionate about making this as my career. I am a professional makeup artist in the making and hopefully I will be done with it soon. I cannot sleep without a blanket or a bed sheet no matter what the weather is and my feet has to be outside the blanket and my entire body has to be inside the bed sheet no matter how hot or cold it is even if I am in Kashmir. Even if I'm freezing cold, uh, my legs would still, like my feet would still be out of the blanket. So yeah, that's one weird fact. I'm a freelance model. Well, modeling came into my life when I was least expecting it. And I am not in the core industry yet, but I hope to be there soon. I love red velvet everything. I mean, from pancakes to pastries to anything red velvet. I mean. I just can't resist it. If you give it to me right now, I can have the whole thing and cheat on my diet. I've been a tomboy more than for half of my life. I mean, I used to have a boy card. It was literally a boy card. I don't know how did this grow. I have no clue. But it just happened eventually and I was mistaken as a boy, as a child. And I mean, it was horrible. I'm a DJ. I've done my certified DJing course a uh, couple of years back and it was more of a hobby uh, and I was really into electronic music, techno, trance, stuff, stuff, you name it and I was totally into it and I still am. I've performed at a couple of quite, quite a few college events I would say and I can't wait for my phone to stop ringing from Yeda Republic, Tris and Jalva now. I'll be waiting for your calls. So when I was really really small, like in the second or the third grade, uh, I wanted to be a painter. I loved sketching, drawing period was my favourite, I mean, I just loved playing with colours, throwing here and there and not the crayons, I loved uh, oil paints and the watercolours and everything, I used to love them and I would spend hours painting and I wanted to be a painter for a really long time. I love singing. I mean, I really wish that other people would have also loved to hear me sing, but they don't. I am not blessed with a full voice. But that doesn't stop me from singing at all. And I found an alternative to my love for music. I have bought an ukulele and I'm in the process of learning it. So my Instagram will hopefully be spammed with it. With my new music covers, I hope so. I have a thing for scented vanilla candles. I mean, they lift up my bad mood any day, anyhow, anywhere, and I just love them. It just is so calm and so soothing. Gift me one, please. People are usually a cat person or like a dog person, but I'm a dog person, I'm a cat person, and I'm an elephant and a hippo person. I love these animals. An elephant is my spirit animal I think. I love dogs. I am obsessed with dogs. I've wanted to have a dog all my life but I can't have one right now. I'm not allowed to and I mean I just love animals. I have two bumps on my forehead. I mean you can't 
literally see it on video or in real life if you meet me but if you touch if i touch this part it it is elevated and i was just a very mischievous kid i have fallen down an iron gate while i was playing on it and it hit me and i've fallen off a cradle and yeah i have two bumps which i don't think are ever going away i watch a lot of tv series of different genres but my all time favorite i mean the most favorite tv show of mine is it has to be game of thrones i it was very unexpected uh, i never thought i would end up liking it but i love it and i hammer every person in my life who is not seen game of thrones to watch game of thrones other than that i love friends gossip girls i have been watched on it a million times one day at a time the rain i mean i can go on but these are some of my favorites I've been into sports all my life. I started off pretty early as a kid. Uh, I am a badminton player. I have played for the states, and I am an athlete too. And now I am a cross-functional trainer, and I train kids. That's like a hobby. As a teenager, I've always wanted to be a marine biologist. I mean, I wanted to be a painter when I was really, really small. But marine biologist was like a serious dream. I had researched colleges and everything, and kept and. I mean I'm just fa very fascinated with underwater I have been through I've been fascinated by it all my life mermaids whales you name it and I love writing writing for myself I've been doing that since forever and this I don't know I just love writing by the ocean and just spending time alone and writing has always been my thing if I had the doraemon anywhere door right now right here with me and i could go anywhere i would go to the north poles and live in an igloo and i'm serious if i could have one food item for the rest of my life and only that it would be fish i love fish fish is the love of my life i mean i can't even begin to go on with my love for fish and how deep it goes and i just love it I'm really good with spellings. I was fortunate enough to represent India at the international level with a few more students, uh, with a few more Indian students, and I'm really proud about it. I am a spicy food lover. You can't imagine the capacity of spiciness I have. Like I, I can have raw chilies. I have I eat I love eating raw uh, the red chili paste yeah I love the eating that raw the paste and I mean yeah don't unsubscribe my second toe is taller than my toe like the first toe and it just felt funny so if I had to choose between beach and mountain yes you guessed it wrong. I would choose both. I mean, I love underwater, but I love mountains too. I've been about nature all my life, and yeah, yes to Kashmir too and Goa too. So I am a really smart shopper, and by that I mean I spend money really wisely on items that I purchase. Like if I have to buy something online, I spend like two or three days of uh, thinking over it if I really need this product in my life. and if i keep thinking about it and if the product doesn't go out of my head i end up buying it but i think a lot before buying i am obsessed with the color blue anything blue just i mean yeah you can see that i love reading books i have always read a lot of books and the alchemist is my most favorite book it really inspired it has inspired me I have a supernatural power. I can hold my tongue. Uh, only a few, like only one in a million people, can do it, and I am the one. I am the one. So wait, I'll show you all. <laughs> wait, I can do that again. So guys, these were the 25 random and not so random facts about me. Please don't get freaked out. I will see you all super soon. Till then, keep subscribing, keep sharing, and keep liking. And lots of love to everyone. And see you all super soon. Bye.